Good morning, Team Winston. I'm calling it quits. Actually, what I'm saying is we did amazing. It's time to move on. That's, that's kind of what I'm saying. And I just jumped into the truck with no keys. So I gotta go get Tyler. He's still in some pain from chasing Stella. If you don't know what I mean, go watch our other channel, the farm channel. But we chased Stella in the woods for hours. Tyler's hip and back are still hurting him. We're only like 36 hours from that excursion. Oh my goodness. I still have hay in the back of the truck from when I, uh, we're gonna go get the keys while we talk from when we had to bring the goat to the vet that had the limpy foot. But we're talking about Winston here. Winston, the car. The fuel pump is in. We're gonna play with that this weekend, but we're so disorganized, the toolbox, right? You guys did amazing. You raised 70% to the goal. I'm calling it quits. I'm calling it quits. I'm shutting that thing down. So if you wanna jump in, jump in now. We'll get you guys on the team Winston board so you can go on the wall. But I have to shut that down because we're moving on to other things. Okay, now we're good. I got my wallet and my keys. I almost forgot both. So yeah, we're shut from the time of this video's update. 24 hours later, that Winston wall project is being shut down. Um, like I said, at this point, we're at 70% to goal, but it sounds like Home Depot only has one left. So I'm going to get it. I got to stop at Tyler School, give him some Moultrin, you know, help him out a little so he can get through the school day. And then I got to do some grocery shop. Today's my day out. I take one day a week, pretty much is what I try. I literally everywhere. Lowe's, Home Depot, Tractor Supply, Walmart, Target, you name it. I'll go everywhere. And we've got even the gas station possibly. Yeah, I have to go get alfalfa for the goats. I have to get this toolbox because I don't want them selling it out. Plus, I'm going to pull the credit card trick. I'm going to put it on my Lowe's credit card, get 10% off right? That'll drop the toolbox from $998 down to like $900. I'll save like 98 bucks. You guys raised 70%. So that's about 700 bucks. So there's a $200 gap. I'll cover the $200 gap right now. That's no, no problem. We'll make that work. And then we'll get it in the truck and get it home, hit up Costco's. For... I forgot to take the hay out. Oh, well, I'll figure that out. We'll hit up, oh, it smells like freaking goat poop in here though. I think I'm gonna take the hay out right here on the side of the driveway. Oh, um, yeah, and then I'll literally pay the credit card off when I come home, or tomorrow. I'll let it hit the credit card and I'll literally pay it off. Uh, actually, I gotta withdraw all the money from the funds that you guys did and they take like 25 bucks and like 2% or something silly. Oh shoot, I'm not gonna make it through the, uh, I'm not gonna make it through the, through the thing because the gate's gonna close on me. Oh, she peed on the floor too. Oh man, it's coming out. Here it comes, everybody. Yep, I'll clean that up when I get home. Oh man, this is what happens. This is now a farm truck when you bring your goat to the vet in your truck. Uh, maybe I'll vacuum it while I'm out, if we have time. Oh, I gotta return that. That'll get me $10 back to the toolbox. Gonna return that. Okay, mom's gonna be like, why is there hay and goat poop in the driveway? Yeah, we'll clean that up later. So yeah, if you're not familiar and you're only here for the Volkswagen project, this is the kind of stuff we put on our other channels, just life in general. And uh, general life on a goat farm, but we're gonna go get it. We're gonna get the toolbox home and we're gonna clean up the garage, organize, and start working on all the projects we have. Okay, we're not there yet, and I just thought of something. Uh, this was just stop number one at Costco's. And uh, yes, I opened the bag of chips already. I needed something, I'm starving. Um, we got a few other stops before we get to the toolbox. After all that, I wasn't in the mood for a chicken bake or pizza at Costco's, so we go. What am I gonna do? Moe's or sandwich? Moe's or sandwich? Okay, what did I have for lunch? Burrito or grinder? Can you guess? Put it in the comments below. I probably should have ate at home, saved some money, because so far the total between Costco's and Walmart. By the way, the pile got bigger. 
I, and I literally buy Walmart brand almost everything. Cereals are Walmart brand. Like granola bars are Walmart brand. Just about everything. The total between the two is more than the toolbox. And that's monthly. It's just about once a month. It's crazy. I think the goats eat a lot. Should see what this family goes through. All right, enough about that. We are heading over to, it's actually not Lowe's, it's Home Depot. I might've made a mistake earlier. Not sure if I did. We're heading to Home Depot. Hopefully they still have that last one in stock. Take a look at this. Those ones you see are super small and the red one I didn't like. But uh, I'm actually not gonna take it now. I'm gonna come back later and get it with a little landscape trailer because picking it up into the truck and lowering it back down could be very difficult without the right kind of help. So I'm gonna grab Kevin's landscape trailer and bring it back because that's got that's way lower to the ground. So we should, I don't think it has a ramp. Maybe I'll get the dirt bike ramps. I don't know, but we're gonna figure out in a couple hours. Come back, grab it, and bring it back home, okay? The good thing about grocery shopping when the kids aren't home is that you can take your time, you can buy what you want, you don't get influenced by children. The bad thing is I got nobody to help me. But that's okay, mom's making soap. She needs to keep making soap. I am going to park the truck on the front lawn, so it's right there by the front door, and I can go faster. Unloading, and then get set up to go all the way back out to get the toolbox. I wasn't kidding right on the front lawn. Literally line that up to the door. It took me two hours to put the food away. Between other little things I had to do and put the food away and organize and all that stuff and figure out what's for dinner, what's going in the freezer, what's not, all that. It literally, I got home at 2.30 and it's now 4.30 and we're taking Olivia to gymnastics and we're picking up the thing. I don't know what thing. He doesn't know what thing, so that's why I didn't say it. We're picking it up. We got Kevin's trailer hooked up, hopefully it's hooked up correct. What I mean by correctly is we couldn't read on the side of the trailer what size ball hitch. So we tested and we put on a one and seven eighths, which is pretty good. Hopefully it's not a two inch. If it's a two inch, it's an eighth of an inch off right now. And that's not, not good. If we're running a two inch, if it needs to be a two inch and we're running a one and seven eighths, that'd be bad because then it would be loose and it could pop off. So hopefully we're not, we'll find out soon. I'm so confused. Back up, silly. I'm right here. Nice. Have a look. It's good. That yeah, looks good. Okay, I'm gonna need a lot more. Why don't you put that on the bumper? Bumper this? Yeah, put it there. Then don't let it fall though. Still. I don't okay, know. Grab me another one. I don't know how. That, that looks. That's fine. We'll figure it out. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Let me have the other end. Quinn, you had no idea, huh? No. No clue. Okay, it's all tight. This can't even wiggle. Look, it wiggles the whole trailer. See yeah. that? Yeah, it does. So, it right now, right now, the whole trailer and the trailer and the toolbox have become one. 
which is exactly what we want, which scares me because the trailer's on a little bit of a tilt because that's not dropping low enough and there's no gate. So it's literally being held on by the brakes, by the brakes of the toolbox on the wheels and all these ratchet straps and they're all nice and tight. This thing's, uh, Quinn, what are you doing? Up a little more? Okay, I don't like that, that's on. Okay, let's tighten this one one more time. There we go. All right, we're ready to go. Let's get out of here. Yep. Did you ask mom about this? Why, why, wait a second. <laughs> he literally just asked me if I asked mom about this. Of course I asked mom about this, but why would I have to ask mom if I want to buy a toolbox? Uh because it's too much money because it's too much money he's right we do have a rule it's like 50 bucks we don't spend 50 bucks without talking to each other that's pretty much our rule i don't know if that still happens it kind of does all right here we go oh what man my phone is doing. it's back there yeah hang on buddy i gotta talk about this toolbox you're telling me stories he's telling me stories about when stella went missing well we made it home it's here it made it, it's still on there real tight. Yep, still on there, not going anywhere. The next task is to try to figure out how to get it off. Okay, some pasta meatballs. Now it's time to unclip this thing and see if I can get it off. Oh man, this could be, this could be interesting. Look at me, I'm starting to get organized already. So I got it off, now the question is how do I get it off the rest of the way? But at least my ratchet straps are all nice and neatly organized. There goes that idea. I was hoping to get this in the garage before Tyler got home. Slow down! You're dr Stop! And you're driving way too fast. Go over there. Go. Over there. My goodness, he's a maniac. All right, here we go. This is how we're going to do it. We're going to... What? You don't have, like, any... I know I don't have enough tools. That's next. Okay, uh, he's picking on me. All right, you're just gonna watch. Purposely gonna thump, but that'll be okay, I think. We're gonna go right here, look at this. We'll just say it was manufacturer error. It's like a little stand. So this should work. It's gonna thump on first, so unlock the wheel. Ooh. Go ahead, unlock the other side. You get it? Yeah, it's not defaulty. Hey, no, hang I on, just... hang on, yep. pay attention. We're right on the edge. Yeah. So now we're gonna go over this. So if I lift here, we should be able to get over this little metal thing. Right. But then the whole thing is, you need to just hold on to that handle because mm -hmm. it is gonna thump onto its like bottom. Yeah, belly. Belly. You Can get you it? check how thin that belly was? Um, no, it's got a rail going okay. all the way down it. <clears throat> all right, oh, ready? Yep. Okay, hang on. Are ready? Yeah. It's gonna thump. Real slow. Boom. That's what we wanted. So now, slow. Back to its wheels. It's, the wheels just yep, hit. Yep, I'm, now I'm, I'm coming over there with you. Yeah. We're both gonna have to lift it. Yep, yeah, so get down. We're gonna get a hand under it and a handle. Oh, I'm not gonna do that. And we're gonna I... get it under the ground. Ready? But we're gonna have to thump it. No. Ready? I'm not gonna be able to do this. Just Guide it down. One, two, three, go. Not bad. We did it. Good, good. Okay, bring me into the garage. Okay. <laughs> okay, don't crash. Uh, I actually want to put the handle on the like other side. Manual? There's no manual. What are you talking about? Did you get like a piece of paper? Yeah. It's right here. Hang on. Give me a minute. This is so you guys don't steal my key, my tools. Uh, get that. There you go. That's my favorite oh, drawer wow. out of the whole thing. That's your manual. That's my favorite drawer. It's the full length and it came with all the pads. It came with them. No, 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 no. Oh, hey, what the heck? That's so mean. Well, it's so mean, yes. It came. Oh, look at that. Oh, came wait, wait. with drawer liners. I know. Well, you can't like. Yeah. 
This is what I love. I mean, the deep drawers. The deep drawers on the bottom are nice. I like them. So Very you can nice. just throw all your uh, air tools in them. Yeah, that'll be air tools down there. So this is interesting. Let me tell you guys something. I said I was going to put it on the credit card to get the, like, discount they give you. It's only 5% discount if you spend over a certain amount of money. And the problem is this was Home Depot. I don't have a Home Depot credit card. But this was the only one they had in stock. Display model. This is exactly what I wanted. The display model. So then we saw all this, right? All this on here. And I didn't touch it. I didn't know. I was like, look, it's a toolbox. It's going to get banged up. This toolbox is going to outlive me. This kid here is probably going to get it in my will someday. Don't wish anything, but you know, 30, 40, <laughs> I'm, not wish I'm just saying 30, 40, 50 years from now, you think about it, the red toolbox over there I've had for 30 years. Okay. So, You're gonna have to replace this wood a few we'll probably times. replace the wood a couple times, which you can do. That's why the screws are shown. Yeah. You just pop it out, put a new piece of wood on and put it back. Yeah. But my point is this thing's going to outlive me. I get it home. They save, they take a hundred dollars off because of all the scratches. And then Tyler. Show us what you figured out. They're not scratches at all. They're not scratches. They're just like little, oh, right here. It's like oh, chalk or something. Oh, this is bird That's poop. bird poop. Right here. That's there bird a poop. Because mom hit a shopping cart. Oh, sh quiet. And so yeah. Stick, rub the okay. Of the it, it's and it it's probably gr carts. Yeah, it could have been carts at the Home Depot, whatever. They gave me a hundred bucks off because they said it had uh, scratches. And I noticed that over here, over here, well, I'm zoomed in way too far. See all that? That none of that scratches. Nope. Wanna know what's funny? Mm. I even bought paint to touch it up. I didn't know these weren't scratches. So I got some new paint that we don't need. I do need to move the handle to the other side. The way my garage is laid oh, out, the so handle's gonna go. It's because these tires rotate, these tires don't. Yeah, but they also put the a handle option on this side. Oh, well, they, they do. They didn't come off a second so, one? No, but you can move the handle to whatever side you want. Yep, and it even comes with a soda opener. Oh, wow. Just kidding, that's beer. But it'll work for your soda too. If well, we, I don't. We don't no. get any glass. Sometimes ones. we do. We go to that fancy root beer place. Oh well, yes. Yes. Can't thank you guys enough for making this happen. It Wait. almost brings a tear to my eye. So so. so. Yeah, it, 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 it almost does bring a tear to my eye that it's here. Now we got to plug it in. But now, where are we gonna put it? Uh, you can can you open bay three? You you can figure out. Where I don't know where it's going. I really don't. Winston, we're getting ready. To make it so you can work. By the way, don't tell Jace. Oh, I won't. He'll know once this video goes out. Yeah, but, well, all right. Probably watch your he does watch my videos sometimes. Oh, that's a problem right there. Can I, can I say something? Oh, uh, uh, what? If anybody is in the area, I got all of these outboard motors for sale. I jack in my video. I'm sorry. All right, that's it. We're going now. Team Winston is out.